शो दैट द रिलेशन आर इन द सेट कैपिटल आर ऑफ रियल नंबर्स डिफाइंड एज आर इज इक्वल टू ए कम बी सच दैट ए इज लेस देन आर इक्वल्स टू बी स्क्वेर वेर ए एंड बी आर रियल नंबर्स सो हि दिस इज सेट ऑफ रियल नंबर्स एंड दिस इज अ रिलेशन सो लेट एस चेक फॉर रिफ्लेक्सिव the condition for reflexive for every element from the set r that is for every a belongs to r a comma a must belongs to the relation so this is a reflexive condition now let us consider an element for 1 by 2 belongs to real numbers we have 1 by 2 whole square is 1 by 4 which is also a real number but 1 by 2 is not less than or equals to 1 by 4 that is 1 by 2 comma 1 by 2 and does not belongs to the given relation so for one element in the set r of real numbers it is not satisfying 1 by 2 comma 1 by 2 does not belongs to the relation and hence we can conclude that the given relation r is not reflexive now let us check for second symmetric the condition for symmetric is if a comma b belongs to r then b comma a must belongs to r for a and b are real numbers so here let us consider an example let 1 by 2 comma 1 belongs to r since we know that 1 by 2 is less than or equals to 1 square that is 1 by 2 is less than or equals to 1 which is satisfying the relation and now 1 comma 1 by 2 does not belongs to the given relation since 1 is not less than or equals to 1 by 2 whole square that is 1 by 1 is not less than or equals to 1 by 4 so for 1 by 2 comma 1 where 1 and half are real numbers 1 by 2 comma 1 belongs to a relation but 1 comma 1 by 2 is not satisfying the condition and hence we can say this relation r is not symmetric at least one example if we can show that which is not satisfying we can conclude that the relation is not symmetric among the set r of real numbers and now let us check the third one transitive and the condition for transitive is if there exists two ordered pairs a comma b belongs to r and b comma c belongs to r and then we have to prove for a comma c must belongs to r then it is transitive now let us consider the two ordered pairs which is the which is satisfying the relation say 7 comma 3 belongs to r since 7 is less than or equals to Three square. That is, seven is less than or equals to nine, which is satisfying the condition. And three comma five by two belongs to the relation R, since three is less than or equals to five by two whole square. That is, three is less than or equals to twenty five by four. So by doing cross multiplication, three fours are twelve. Twelve is less than or equals to twenty-five, which is satisfying. 
and so to prove that this is not transitive so we need to consider an ordered pair 7 comma 5 by 2 consider 7 comma 5 by 2 such that 7 such that 7 is less than or equals to 5 by 2 whole square whether we have to check this is true or false which implies 7 is less than or equals to 25 by 4 so that is 7 for the 28 is less than or equals 25 which is false so 7 comma 5 by 2 does not belongs to r which is not satisfying the given relation so 7 comma 3 satisfying and 3 comma 5 by 2 is satisfying if these two ordered pairs are there in the relation so definitely 7 comma 5 by 2 must be there if it is not satisfying we can conclude that the relation is r is not transitive so with this we can just confirm that the given relation r is neither given relation r is neither reflexive symmetric not transitive